What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And it's a video of Lil JoJo that's trending on the internet right now. People been asking me about it, putting me in Twitter mentions, adding me. I guess it's a video that's floating around the internet of a guy like on a bike. And then I guess it's a shooting and then you see the friend run off and shit like that. I can't verify 100% that that video is JoJo. Um, I can't tell you that. Now, I'm not saying it's not. I'm not saying it is. I understand a lot of people believe that the video is authentic. Um, I'm not going to lie. It kind of look rare as fuck, this type of video. But I'm not here to make no rumors up or support any rumors. I can't verify if that's JoJo in the video. But I can tell you there's been a lot of rumors about um, that rap song, BDK. And, you know, I think when King Lil J did the interview with Say Cheese TV and he spoke on how he was shot several times while defending Lil JoJo, uh, I think that kind of egged on, you know, more speculation and rumors and shit like that. Um, one thing I can tell you is, you know, some shit is strictly street shit. It's not really for the internet. And that's the reason why Lil JoJo death and shit like that's not on the internet. You see documentaries and rumors, but you don't see nobody pinpointing one suspect and shit like that because that's real street shit. It's not for the internet. Um, I'm going to tell you, though, I done spoke with a lot of people that said that the real got this all the way wrong. The BDK song dropped, so, you know, it kind of brought authenticity to the rumors that people were saying. But a lot of people told me that, you know, JoJo death was some street shit that didn't have nothing to do with no rap song. And that maybe, you know, it was extra anger and pissed off on him because of that rap song. But I was just told that this was some street game banging shit that happened in the streets. And people know what happened in the streets. And it's not for the internet, you know. So that's why I say it's kind of hard for me to verify that video, especially when like nine, ten years in past, then a video comes out, and then it comes out on the blog sites, you know. It don't come out like on a bunch of big, big platforms that kind of stamp this shit. So that don't mean it ain't real though, because the bloggers be working getting these type of contents and shit like that. That's why I say. I'm not here to verify it. I'm not here to kind of downplay it. But I am here to say that, you know, in this culture, this shit is real. You know, JoJo hasn't been linked to things trending lately in the culture. JoJo haven't been linked to any rap songs with ops like dissing him lately and shit like that. So that's the reason why, you know, we don't really speak on a lot on JoJo because he hasn't. His name hasn't been, like, in the culture lately, like, trending. Even though I think he's king of drill, I think JoJo was as big as Chief Keith was in the streets while Keith was big in the street. You know what I'm saying? I think people don't understand that. And I think JoJo's name should be higher on the drill, king of drill list, in my opinion. That's why I'm going to start asking a lot of artists in these interviews to give me their top five king of drill of all time lists and shit like that. But I'm here to say I can't verify that video. You know, but I have talked to a lot of people in the hood that have told me strictly that this is street shit, you know. Uh, and that's the reason why that shit not on the internet, you know. So, maybe there's other platforms that can verify that video, but truth can't, you know. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's the homie Truth Tell This Report.